Hey guys, it's Dr. Kirby here and we're back with another video. In today's video, as you can see from my subscriptions over here, uh, Skin Spotlights Wilder has posted some new, um, what do you call this? Some new uh, spotlights uh, for patch 4.1. Now I've heard that these were the leak ones and I was right, these were the accurate ones. So let's begin this reaction. Um, if you're new to my channel, make sure you guys subscribe for more content on like league stuff. Um, one thing to note before we start is that they're not done uploading the rest of the content. So, you know, I might pause the uh, recording and then wait for the new one to come up because I don't know how much we're going to get. Um, let's start with classic Urgot first. Okay, hold up. We need to make this HD, not 4K, HD. Let's go. So it's gonna be Urgot and Twitch, I think, for this patch. Until you are broken. Ew, that is disgusting. I mean, the mod looks great. You know, we're not gonna go too deep into it. This is not like a like a worth a buy review. I thought he was gonna take off his mask. What is he sipping? Is it like the is it like Squid Game where you they trap you in a car and then just put you to sleep? That's a really good uh, 3D mod. I wonder what does the in-game mod look like. His body looks so messed up. How do you pee? Okay, I don't want to talk about that. Okay, let's move on. Thank you. It's getting awkward. <coughs> I choke. Okay, his model is actually not bad. A little big. No, not this. Not this passive. The one, two, three, four. Good luck to all the 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 Wild Drift mobile players uh, doing that passive. This passive. This passive. See, you have to walk around, girl. That's his third skill, right? Oh wait, that's his W, I think. His third skill is a movement thing, right? Yep. Little flip, like a cinch flip, because cinch made him. <laughs> okay, nice shield. The barrier looks a little low quality to me. That's his ultimate. How does it work? Oh, it's the same thing. Ooh, ooh, you got, you got drilled, girl. I mean sod. And you can press the alt again to come back. Okay, that makes sense. Let's see what the ultimate looks like. That was such an awkward animation. She shrinks and then she kind of pops up a little bit. They need to fix that. That This is still in beta, obviously. This is the PvE. Ooh, this, ooh, they got the PC animation stuff. Ew, I can't believe we have Urgot now. Oh no. Range top laner, huh? Wait till Quinn pops up. Oh, and he down. Well, that's who he is. Is the splash art animated? It isn't. Whoa, this is beta. Dang, I, I know this was a login screen. Dang. Okay, let's move on to the next um, thing. Are, is, it, is there gonna be a thing here? Nope. Oh, there we go, they did it for me. No, what are you doing? <laughs> let's move on to the next video, which is the High Noon Orgot skin. Why is it High Noon though? He had other skins. The Star Garden one would have been nice, but people like the badass skins, unfortunately. They don't want like the cutesy ones. Okay, we love the steampunk vibe. I think they're expanding the skin line. That's why they're expanding it so much. They're adding a lot of the High Noons as their like base skin, like their first skin on release. It's a furnace. I'm curious about the graphics. I don't really see the skin much, but I'm curious how it would reflect on PC. 
Once again, this is not an extended review. This is just a normal reaction. Okay, I don't know if I'm too loud for... I don't know if the music's too loud for the background. Okay, let's see this model. Oh, it's not bad. The furnace is... At least you can see the furnace details there. Ooh, pretty. Look at that chimney. Okay, the passive is the flame, kind of like charcoal-y, like burst of flame. That's a dynamite. The dub was such a weird animation. That's the W. The, the, oh, it's what's that called? There's a word for these types of it's flame thingy. Like the the heat stamp. I think that's the word heat stamp. You know when they what they use in the cow when they burn the cow's butt. I don't know. <laughs> okay, that shield is a little dark. I mean, at least it wasn't bright. It matches the tone of this, at least. That's not bad. I like that the when they activate that ability, there's different marks. There's different marks to these. That's nice. I don't want to be deep into it. Ooh, a bull pops up. Yep, a bull. I don't know why. I guess Wild West. In Wild Rift. What does it look like? Oh, it looks like a train track. That's cool. I don't know what this is resembling. Let's see the ultimate. Not bad. That's gonna be such easy to dodge. Wrong English. <laughs> gonna be easy to dodge because it's such a short skill shot. It's good on close range, but if you're far, you could get, you could dodge it. Wait, what did the effect look like? Oh, it's a bit different. It's a bit more on to the right compared to the to to here last time. Okay, girl. Uh huh. Look at them bullets. Okay, I know for sure the slasher is not gonna be different, obviously, because it's somewhat a recent skin. Yo, what happened to that? Is that how he actually did animations? What was that stretch? Is this a new splash art? This looks like an old splash art. Because I know he came with the, the Samira High Noon one, right? Back in PC. This is a bit of a new skin. Okay, now let's move on to Vi. Before that, let me... Wait, before that, let me just look at High Noon or God Splash Art on my phone. Before we look at the splash art. This, this, this High Noon Ergot came out in 2018. Oh, the splash art's the same. Okay. Okay, now... We need to talk about something annoying now. Next, it's Superhero Vi. <clears throat> now, I, I'm, I'm so tired of the Superhero skin line. I hope this is the last. Because if the psychic thing, the psychic detective thing didn't go so long, why is this happening so long? I'm tired. I mean, I did max the battle pass. Even though I haven't played in a while, but, you know. Okay, there's Vi. She's not going to have a skin for a long time. I think her last skin was arcade. <laughs> No, it wasn't. It was Crystal Rose. That was her last skin. Crystal Rose by. That was her last skin. I guess they made another one because it was a limited skin, a gotcha skin. I mean, yeah. It makes sense for like by stands for violence. She's kind of giving um, what's that word? Miss Marvel, Kamala Khan, with her big hands. She looks like her hands are malleable and stretchable. Oh, I'm curious about the ascended version. Okay, we love the whatever this is. I mean, red. Okay, that's okay. Okay, that's Captain Marvel right there. What? She looks more cosmic. I mean, you can still see the same colorings here, but then they added some pink access here, some orange, light orange. She, she that was Miss Marvel, and that was Captain Marvel. That was the vibe I'm getting. Yeah. At least, okay. At least the thing about this is it's way more different compared to this because in the in the few superhero villain skins they were kind of close resembling each other even if they were the opposite colors of each other at least play around with some other colors in the spectrum rather than just you know polar opposites 
need to be down. Okay, the same effect, but at least they improved that effect though. Not bad. The shield breaking, nice. Comic book shield break look. There's those half tones again that I'm seeing. Wow, that's a really nice. That's a new effect I haven't seen from them. Interesting. It's like a, z a zap effect, which is not bad. Oh, and it flames up after. That's not bad. It's this that punch look gives more arcade, and then you can see that uh, the dots are back, the half tones. I'm tired of that. I'm trying not to go deep into it. I don't want it to be. <laughs> there was a smoke effect there. The hit spark. Oh, look at that light. Oh, this is a, not a bad barrier. That's not bad. I like it. It kind of it's moving around as you can see there. It's an illusion of moving around. Not bad. Okay, I like the passive, the the mark. Okay, that's her E, I think. That's her third skill. Is there something in that effect or no? Okay, just a normal woof and then pow. Okay, no. Let's see. I have all the skins except Jace, so if I get this then... Ooh, a thud. Nice. Okay, does something change in her look? No. Thud! Look at that spark on the ground. Okay, there's a lot of improvements in this graphic. I'm doing this my way. There's some like weird like sonar effect here on the side. It's giving like... I think that's the zap effect from her punch. Not bad. I wish if we we're looking at the ascended version, I wish the colors of the VFX changed to the matching colors of the skin. But that's a prestige at this point. I'm over here. Yeah. Okay, let's see this one. Yeah, it's the same colors. The same VFX startup. It's basically a chroma. But the model looks great at least. I kinda like the blue hair, it's giving like an anime, like charged up moment. Um, the purple. I would prefer using this. That's the thing I like. I kind of don't like the, the, the ascended skin sometimes because of the look. Um, but I like this one. I like this one. Um, you know, I think Graves was meh. Jin was okay. Uh, okay, this is her splash art. Okay, so your rival is... That's Jin's gun. So I'm guessing she's the superhero for that. Then who's Graves' villain? Jace? Um, her splash art looks great. She looks very different. She looks like a... She looks like x -Borg from Mobile Legends. <coughs> I have to say that. Because, you know, that's the aesthetic he had when he was released. Um, but yeah, I don't know if I'm going to get the Battle Pass. We don't know. You know, I've been, I've been playing a lot of PC and TFT lately. Okay, finally, we're going to a different theme in the... What's that word? In the rank skins. Someone in the comments told me long ago uh, that they, only, they do four themes and then they're done. So I guess... Nami was the last in the batch, and this is the 23, 2023 batch. So let's see. I'm actually glad it's a TF skin because I want a TF skin. <laughs> he looks great. That hat's a little big. This is giving Desert Arabian vibes now. We're in a different vibe. Armada. Glorious Armada is giving like a desert theme vibe. Egypt. I won't be surprised if Akshan gets one. If he gets a skin here. He's gonna be like, we've been you. He looks like a train conductor with that hat. You know, like the one in Pokemon Black and White. Ooh, that was a pretty red card. The pants. Oh, look at those drip pants. I love that. Oh, I don't know why he needs the knuckles. He's not gonna punch. The knuckle braces. There was a knuckle brace. Um, overall, it fits his aesthetic. The hat is just big. You can see a dragon here. Yeah, love the detail here. They were really improving. And it's... And is that claws, like like golden claws on the left side of his arm? I guess that's his hand card. Maybe that's why. Wait, why is there two versions? What difference am I looking at? Girl, I don't know. Ooh, the, the cards look great. They look great, and it a lot of golds. Okay, never mind. That's randomized. Those are pretty. They look like a card back for like lore. Okay, so we got what was the what was the design? So we got an eye-ish, a hook. I guess it's the C theme then, if the, that's what you're talking about. And then a chain, a chain hook, an anchor. Interesting. Ooh, wow. 
I'm just it's a pretty good looking skin. This is this has gotta be 1350 quality at least. Oh wow. <laughs> Look at that. Anchors. Wow. I know this is still like a 725 uh, wildcore quality because of the intro. If it has a different intro, that means it's an epic skin. The recall seems default. No, I think it's not default. I forgot. Wild, Wild Drift has different recalls even on the cheek skins. Okay. Oh, look at the eye. That's so cool. I think it's a normal eye, slightly redesigned, and they just added this, um, uh, like a headgear on. What does the? Ooh, wow! Is that how his? Is that how his ultimate always looks when he's transported? I don't know. Looks really nice. Hey, why is it? this is different? Oh, right, the ultimates for when you play legendary ranked, which we're probably never gonna get because no one plays legendary rank in my region at least. Oh, the recalls. Okay, that animation looks the same, but the eye is different. Weird. No destiny. Look how look that's so pretty. It's like dragon vibe. Dragon underwater sea vibe. Weird. So that's his crit. Okay, that's your crit girl. And he fainted. Get graves! Ooh, the splash art is not moving as well. Wow, this is some beta shit. <laughs> This is some beta shit over here. Oh my gosh. This would've looked so good if it's moving. Wow, this is so weird for Riot. Maybe it's very early. Good job, Skin Spotlights. Maybe it was too early in their thing. Okay, I, th I think that's it for now. Let me double check if there's more. Okay, I'm back. I double checked and refreshed the page multiple times. And I don't think there's a more to the upload. Um, I honestly expected Twitch's Spotlight to come out, but it's not maybe i'll make a follow-up reaction the next day if something happens but for now that was my reaction to the patch 4.1 skins and champions that are uh gonna be releasing soon but what that means that when if this is if this if these videos were released that means we're gonna get a patch 4.1 video soon and we're gonna get more details of the upcoming skins there's gonna be more obviously and items and champions that are going to come out and what their plans are going to be. So yeah, uh, that was the uh, 4.1 part 1 reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, like it. If you don't dislike it, make sure you guys subscribe to the notification bell for whenever I upload a new video. The guys I mentioned before, I'm, I, 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 don't, I don't think I'm a Wild Drift YouTuber. I think I'm a League YouTuber now. More like a Riot YouTuber, you know, because most of the content I post here are Riot games related and stuff. So yeah. Uh, make sure you guys uh, join my Discord. Link is in the description below. Make sure you uh, join my PayPal. Join my PayPal. Make sure you donate to my PayPal slash coffee. Um, if you're doing that, you will be helping the channel out in the long run. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll see you guys what in the next one. Bye bye. I ruined my outro. I swear.